It wasn't the best of a rookie year for Denver Broncos 2020 second round pick KJ Hamler for multiple reasons. He dealt with hamstring issues that were lingering and saw him miss a decent amount of time as well as dealing with the drops. When looking at rookie receivers with at least 30 targets, Hamler led them all with an 18.9 drop percentage. That is better than his 25% drop rate in college, but he still has a lot of room for improvement. He is small and light, but fast and explosive. So you want to get the ball into his hands quickly so he can make a play. With a higher drop percentage, it makes it hard for the quarterback to trust him in certain situations and look away from him. That's going to limit Hamler a lot, which is just part of why his hands need to improve to survive the NFL game. Improving the hands would also make him more effective as a player, and that's what the Broncos really need from him. One thing that can really help Hamler is being better utilized by Pat Shermer, which is somewhat out of Hamler's control. Shermer didn't use Hamler the best last year, and there could be multiple reasons why, like the hamstring issues, the drops, or Hamler struggling to pick up the playbook. All of those are valid reasons, but the explosive playmaker that Hamler is has to be better used this year, and that is on Shermer. There is no reason to doubt Hamler taking a step forward this year, but he has to improve those hands and stay healthy for that to really happen. For Mile High Huddle, I'm Eric Trickle.